Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel, welcome to another vlog. I'm currently getting ready. It is Monday, um, and I think we're going to do a week of my life. Um, so I'm going to try and vlog every day this week. Um, I have a pretty busy week, so I thought why not take you along with me. I have two weddings this week. One of them I'm actually a guest um, at as well, so that will be fun. Um, I have some other makeup appointments. I think I have, I think I have like two or three spray tan appointments. Um, and I have a lot of computer work I have to get done to this week. So yeah, we just have a lot to do. So I figured why not do a week in my life? Um, I have like a lot of admin work I have to do this week because I gotta get ready for taxes. Um, I probably should do quarterly taxes for my business, but I don't. <laughs> so, um, I don't know, maybe I'll start them this year. But anyway, I'm just trying to get ready because it is Monday morning, it's 8.18. 8, and I have to go to the dentist. So I'm just throwing on a little bit of makeup so I didn't scare them because I looked so tired this morning. I sound tired, like I feel tired. I'm very, very tired. Um, but yeah, I'm just putting on a little bit of makeup so I didn't scare them away. <laughs> um, and then I don't really know what the plan is after that. I have like a million things I need to do. I probably will come home and get some work done on the computer. I gotta get back to some clients. Um, I was gonna work yesterday on the computer, but I didn't, so I gotta get back to everyone this morning. Um, and I gotta do some editing. I also have to film for benefit. I have to film the reels. I have to, um, I wanted to film a YouTube video too, aside from this vlog, I wanted to actually put up a tutorial, like a get ready with me using like all new products. Um, I thought that that would be kind of fun. So I don't know, it's Monday, I have a million things on my to-do list and I'm exhausted, but um, yeah, thanks for watching. Um, hope you're subscribed. If you aren't already, please hit that subscribe button. Um, we are very close, very, very close to 17,000, and I'm hoping to get to 20,000. Um, but yeah, I guess just follow me around this week. <laughs> Hello, you guys. It's a little bit later in the day. I'm currently sitting here trying to get motivated. I have my computer. I have my planner, it's a new month tomorrow, so I like to go through when it's a new month, go through what I made for the month prior, and just like prep for a new month, um, write down my goals, prep my calendar, um, all of that. And then I'm trying to get back to clients, I have to send out a contract, I have to confirm both of my weddings this week, my wedding for Friday and my wedding for Sunday. I have to make invoices for both. I have to come up with some sort of schedule for for both. And I have to just get back to a couple other inquiries. That's like the basics of what I need to do. I'm struggling a little bit with getting motivated to do all of that work. So full transparency. Some days when I have to do like admin work like this where I'm on the computer, I'm writing in my planner, I'm making schedules, invoices, all of that. Some days I'm like super motivated. I'm like ready to get that stuff done and I'm like, yeah, let's do it. And I knock it out in like an hour. Other days I struggle and it's really hard for me to find that motivation. I get anxious um, and I just don't wanna do it. I don't know why that happens. I feel like it's because in this, with what I do, the admin work, I feel like is constant. Like it's, there's constant inquiries, there's constant getting back to people. 
um, and there's just always something to be done and since it's constant it's all I think about and sometimes when it's all I think about I get anxiety I get anxious about it I feel this immense pressure that I'm not doing enough or I need to do more or um, I don't know it's just a lot I think if you run a business you would understand what I'm saying I feel like <laughs> I feel like I'm not making sense but I don't know today's one of those days I'm just struggling like I just I'm, I'm not in the mood to like do this type of work be on the computer like I wish I could just be creating and doing something fun but I can't I have to do this stuff um, and to be honest with you guys like the admin days the days where I am on the computer typing away um, getting back to people and all of that stuff is a huge part of the success of my business. Um, if I didn't do all that stuff, if I didn't work on my website all the time, keep it up to date, um, work on my social media pre-planned posts, if I didn't do all of that, my business wouldn't be as successful. And success is relative to you. Um, I say my business is successful because to me it is I'm able to pay my bills and I'm comfortable and if I want to buy something I can so to me it's successful it may not be successful to you or whatever I've talked about this before but success is relative so when I say I've gotten my business to be successful because I'm doing all this admin work it doesn't mean like I'm a millionaire I just want to make that clear like I just think I'm successful because I'm able to live my life and my business does kind of sustain itself now like I don't have to do as much work to make it flow and go but um, I still do it because I have this constant fear that if I don't do all that extra stuff if I don't keep my website up to date if I don't do all of that um, my business is gonna plateau or go down and I don't know that scares me so I'm constantly doing it it's constantly on my head and sometimes it gives me anxiety and then I have days where I don't want to get my work done but anyways I have to do I got cut off but I have to do this work I'm gonna try and push through regardless maybe I'll make myself a coffee sometimes that gives me a little boost um, but yeah I just I have to check off these things on my to-do list and then hopefully later I can film a reels um, I actually really need to I have to film it for benefit because I'm a part of benefit club pink and to be a part of benefit club pink you have to enter like contests every month you have to create content for them um, like twice a month um, and I think I've already met my quota for the month but I really wanted to enter the one contest because the winner gets like a new computer or something like that so I want to enter it because I figure why not um, and I love working with them. They're, they're a really cool brand benefit. So, um, yeah, hopefully I can get everything done so I can do that. Wish me luck. All right. So I've been here. I don't even know. I think about an hour and I think I got everything done. Um, there's probably more shit that I could do, but I got like the basics done. Pretty much confirmed both weddings for the week, did invoices, um, ow, my teeth hurt. Um, got back to my inquiries, added up what I made for the month, um, oh, I have to prep, I have to pre-plan some posts for Instagram, okay. Now I have to go do that, um, but once I do that, I think I'm good, and then I could, then I can film, although I'm really not in the mood to film now, oh my god. Ugh. But I, I really need to, I really need to. Oh man, I'm just a mess. I'm a mess. I just 
finished anything. filming. It is, I don't know if I've come on here yet. I haven't. It's Tuesday. It's the next day. Um, I just filmed a video. I filmed a get ready with me. Oh my god, these contacts are bothering me. I put in these contacts. Um, but yeah, I just filmed that. I did a bunch of editing this morning. Um, nothing crazy, just at home getting work done. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to show my face because I told myself I'm going to pick up the camera every single day this week to really do like a week in my life. Um, so yeah, that is all I did. Um, hopefully I can get this get ready with me filmed. I do have another video that's going to be going up today and then I have another video after that. So this probably won't go up till next week, but yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm just going to clean up this mess. And then probably just, once this is cleaned up, probably just um, get some work done on the computer and wait till my boyfriend gets home. So, that's that. <laughs> hey guys, so I am getting ready right now. It's now Thursday. I don't think I vlogged anything from yesterday, even though I said I was going to vlog every day. Um, I did try turning on the camera at some point yesterday, but... It, my battery was low and then I just kind of ran out of time but here we are you didn't really miss anything yesterday um, yesterday I just what did I do yesterday cleaned did some work on the computer and that was kind of it I didn't do anything crazy and then I went out for my cousin's birthday um, but that was that today is Thursday and today I do have to work um i have a trial at 12 a bridal trial for one of my june brides so um yeah i have that and then i have a three o'clock special event makeup for one of my lovely clients kelsey who you guys actually saw in a vlog i don't know a while ago a couple months ago um but yeah i do her makeup all the time so i'm excited to see her um and then I have two spray tans this evening, so that is my day. It's not like super crazy busy or anything like that, but I feel like anytime I have like more than like two clients in a day, it ends up feeling like such a busy day because like between all of the prep beforehand that I have to do, the cleaning in between client, you know, quickly letting my dog out in between clients, like it's just like... Before you know it, the day is, like, crazy and busy. Um, so, yeah, I have that. And then I also, at some point, have to prep for my wedding tomorrow. I'm excited. I have um, a wedding for my bride, Giovanna. And, um, yeah, I have to get up pretty early. So, that's not fun. I'm going to be up probably at, like, 5 tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I have a wedding tomorrow, so I gotta prep for that. And then I have two clients Saturday, spray tan. And then I have a rehearsal, not a rehearsal dinner, it's a rehearsal lunch for the wedding on Sunday because my boyfriend is in the wedding. And then what else do I have? Um, and then Saturday, Sunday, I have to go do makeup, and then I'm also attending the wedding, so. I have to prep for that as well. So, anyways, I'm going to finish getting ready. My camera is going to die again. And I'll catch up with you guys a little bit later when I'm, like, getting ready for my client. I just wanted to show my outfit for work today. Um, so, this is what I'm wearing. Yeah, so I just wanted to be comfy and casual. So, we're wearing this little button down um like linen type top my mom actually gave this to me yesterday she found it in her closet and i was like i've been looking for a shirt like that one that you could just like throw on on top of anything um really cute um then i'm wearing a crop top from shein i really like this color it's like a burnt orangey brown um jeans are levi's love these got them at marshall's a couple years ago and i wear them all the time um belt is from a garage sale or something like that i don't remember wearing my usual necklaces i have my cross my mom gave me 
McKenna necklace from Vibe Season and this I got at an antique store a long time ago. Um, got a couple rings on. So yeah, that's my outfit. I feel very uh, like 90s kind of, especially with my hair like this. Um, yeah, that's what I'm wearing for work. My client will be here very soon. Got everything set up. Um, sorry if the audio sucks on this video, but my camera is charging. That's why I'm taking it on my phone. But, yeah. Hey, guys. So, it has been quite a day. Um, a good day. It's just, I don't know. I just, I'm tired. But, um, I had two makeup clients. One at bridal trial. One was, um, with one of my regulars. And then now I am, and then I just did a spray tan, and now I have one more spray tan, and then I'm done for the day. Um, so yeah, I'm a little tired, I'm not going to lie. Um, it's just one of those days where I just feel like there's not enough time, there's not enough time to like do what I need to do, but it's okay. Um, so I'm just cleaning up in here because... Um, I have a wedding tomorrow, so I'm trying to clean up my, my kit, um, and, you know, get everything together, um, trying to clean up, get everything together, you know, all that stuff, um, so yeah, that is what I am doing, I'm tired. <laughs> I gotta be up at like five tomorrow. So this is my life, um, and this will be my life a lot moving forward for the rest of the year. Um, I shouldn't say. I mean, there are times where it's not as busy, but um, it's always an adjustment when I get back into like wedding season because I come out of a slow season. So it's like I have to get adjusted to like you know life being super super busy again um and it's a good thing i'm not complaining it's just like i said it's always a little bit of an adjustment so yeah i'm just packing up my kit um and then like i said i have one more spray tan so i'm trying to clean up a little bit so it's not so messy in here because right now i have my spray tan stuff out and i have my makeup kit so I'm just like trying to clean up best I can um, so yeah that is what is going on today um, so while I have a little extra time I'm actually going to start putting together some brush sets for my wedding tomorrow so I'm doing five ladies and I'm going to make five different brush sets so I have a brush set per girl just to save some time. That way I don't have to clean brushes in between clients. So this is going to be for the bride. I'm going to wait to do hers because I'm going to be using some of the brushes that I want in here on my next client today. So I'm going to wait, but I'm going to put one together for, let's just say, a bridesmaid. So I always start off with... Um, some sort of like concealer brush or something so I'm gonna put that in there um, and then I like some sort of brush like obviously a blending brush is very important probably two blending brushes um, we're gonna do a eyeshadow brush so like a packing brush um, a brush like this, like a, I call these like a detail brush, like a smudger brush or something. I'll throw this in there too. Um, so I think that should be good for eyes. And then for face, I do like like a standard foundation brush for skincare, primer, anything like that. Um... I'm obviously going to have a, blue, a beauty blender in here. Um, we need a powder brush. So I'm going to do 
Uh, I'll do this brush. Um, blush brush. In here as well. Um, I'll throw this in too. Why not? Um, highlight brush. This is like multi-use. So, this is going to be a one brush set. Um, now, when I do this method where I bring multiple brush sets, let me actually, like, when I do this method where I bring multiple brush sets, I will also bring, um, like, one of these guys as well and I will just have some extras in here so like extras of each type of brush in here just in case I need um, one I don't have time to clean a brush or maybe I just need another blending brush or something like that so I do keep one of these with some extra brushes just in case um, but yeah the, basically when it comes to doing this um, I just keep like the basics of each brush in in here morning you guys it's currently 6 19 in the morning i'm shoving my face with some toast because i'm about to i just said where's my phone i'm literally recording on my phone <laughs> i'm about to leave for a wedding and i really was not hungry at all but i was like i need to put something in my stomach because I just don't like working on an empty stomach so yeah I'm quickly eating something and then I gotta go um this wedding's only like 30 minutes away which is nice and I'll be done by 11 30 which is really nice I only have five girls to do so yeah that's the plan I'm gonna go do this wedding and then that I'm done for the day um and then later I'm getting a pedicure finally and I'm also going to get a spray tan so yeah I gotta go do this wedding I'm pretty tired I didn't get good sleep last night um, my boyfriend went to go pick up his friend from the airport he's staying with us for a couple days and I knew they were gonna stay up late <laughs> so I like put the fan on in my bedroom and like tried to drown out the noise they weren't loud but I just have a small house so I heard everything and then my boyfriend gets into bed like super late and then starts snoring. And I was like, are you kidding me? <laughs> so, um, and he's not very graceful. Like when he's supposed to be quiet, like when he walks in the bedroom, he thinks he tries. He thinks he's being quiet, but like he freaking like shined the flashlight in my eyes. Like he didn't want to turn on the light. So he put on his phone flashlight and he was like shining in my eyes. I'm like, I'd rather you turn on the lights at this point. But yeah, I got to go. Um... I will talk to you guys a little later. Okay, look down. Look straight. Look down. Look straight. And then look down. Hey guys. So... I am currently, it's Saturday, it's the next day, so I did my wedding yesterday. Um, everything went really well, the bride was super sweet, everyone was really, really nice. So, that's always good. Um, but today is Saturday, I had a couple spray tans, and now I'm getting ready for a rehearsal. It's like a rehearsal dinner, instead it's a rehearsal lunch for the wedding I'm going to tomorrow. Um... So yeah, I just did my makeup. I just did like a soft glam. And then now I'm going to do my hair. We're going to tackle <laughs> this hair. Um, so I use the Revlon dryer. Um, I like this stuff. What I like to do is I like to put any products in as soon as I get out of the shower. So I put the Olaplex bonding oil and the Bond Smoother or it's like a leave-in conditioner by Olaplex. And then I put in a little bit of a, a product from 
Aveda. It's for um, when you're going to be styling your hair with heat. So then I just let my hair air dry because it's best, in my opinion, to blow out your hair when your hair is mostly dry. Um, one, it's better for your hair instead of just going in on wet hair with like a really hot tool like this. It's going to burn your hair. So I like to let my hair dry for the most part. And yeah, I'm just going to blow it out. And then I'm going to put some rollers in it as well. I am. Going nowhere lately It's time to start all over And go for it Cause they don't even They don't even know me yet But that's something I don't regret Good morning I am so tired right now It is Can you see? 4.08 in the morning I have to be at a client's house by 5 15 in the morning and I'm tired it's funny I saw a video on TikTok yesterday and this girl was like I wake up at 4 in the morning and the vibes are just immaculate bitch no the vibes are not immaculate right now the vibes are very much I'm tired that's the vibe at four in the morning. Oh, flattery. Wanna get out of my chips. So oh this is like not flattering lighting at all. Hey guys, so I'm not really sure where I ended on this vlog. Um but um, basically I mentioned that I was going to a wedding and also working the wedding so I did the makeup um, and it was really nice I will insert some pictures um, it was pretty cool to do Nicole's makeup because I did her makeup back in high school when we were friends like for like prom and like random dances and stuff and then to be doing it for her wedding day was pretty cool um, so I had a really good time, did the makeup, um, and then rushed back to my parents' house, got ready, and put myself together, and then, um, went to the wedding, and we had a really, really great time. Um, it was lots of fun. A little too much fun, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> um, honestly, the bartender, such a heavy pour. Like, I've been to a couple weddings, and usually, honestly, the drinks are usually pretty fucking weak. And no, this guy was, like, not playing around. He was like, look, 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 look. It was like Sandra Lee. Two shots of vodka. So, you know, you know. Sandra Lee, that was him. That was him. Um, it was actually, it was a fun time, though. Um, but yeah, basically... That was that. Um, but I'm just going to end off. Hi. Hi, Luna. Thank you. Can I... Can I finish my vlog? Alright, we're just going to have to work around Luna. But yeah, so thank you. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate the support. And I will see you in my next vlog. I don't think I have any other clips to show you after this, but yeah. Anyways, thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button if you haven't already. It really, really helps me out. But I'll talk to you guys later.